welcome to another vlog. I'm running around trying to catch this train to the game, so follow me. Guys, oh wow, what a running around morning. Oh, but I was literally running to catch the 11.05 and I got here at 11.04, so I barely had time to get the ticket and get on the train and get there. Um, but yeah, the game was not very good like the way they were playing, but the seats were pretty good, although I'm more of a you know baseline kind of view. But this was kind of like in between base and left field, kind of. But it, it was literally the second row, like right by the field. Like you could see the outfield, the, the outfielders, like really close. It was really, really cool. Um, and the sun wasn't really out all that strongly, so it was bearable. So at least you weren't sitting in the direct sunlight the whole time. Um, so not bad. And then I got the t-shirt. I'll show you guys all that when I get home. Um, but yeah, um, I was a little annoyed on the way back though, because I caught an earlier train that I was supposed to to get to Secaucus. Um, weekday afternoons, I generally would not drive to Secaucus and pay the parking because it's not seven dollars. It's only seven dollars in the evenings. So I chose to drive to the train station in town and take the train. But the problem is you got to connect to Secaucus and then pick up another train. Um, typically, heading to New York isn't a big deal. But heading back from New York is a big deal because if you miss the connecting one, then you have to wait 30 or 40 or even an hour for the next train, which um, I made it right when the train arrived, but there was no way I had to go all the way upstairs, across, and then down again. By the time I did all that, the train was, was just leaving um, because the train left about three minutes late from Penn Station. So... I don't understand why they, they, get, they make the connection so short, like they should at least give you 10 minutes or something, but oh well. So I'm going to be driving home and finally take a shower, relax, Ooh, what a day. Hey guys, so I did make it home safe after frustratingly waiting half an hour for the damn train. Um, wow, that train was packed. I was going to take a video there, but we were literally up like sardines in this commuter train, so it was not really wise to do that. But let's just say I was riding in between cars, even though the signs tell you not to. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, I had some dinner, and I'm actually going to get into the shower quickly. But I wanted to show you some of the swag that uh, was given out today um, 
for the game, like obviously the shirt that I'm wearing here, but I'm going to take it off and show you the shirt in, the, in its entirety. K is for strike. And the Mets stand for Harvey. I think that's such a cool t-shirt though. And also a Dunkin Donuts gift card thing. Um, only two dollars but I have a couple of them so I, I have like ten dollars saved up in there so that's not so bad. Um, it's actually kind of cool. I like last year's better. It was the 50th anniversary style. It would have been nice if they had maybe the all-star game style on this one but it's still two dollars that I didn't have before. Hi guys so I passed out before I could film a proper ending so some pictures here of the tickets and the tour and the card so don't forget to like and share and comment then I'll see you guys in the next video